This is Get Real Live Television. Okay, this is Susan from Get Real Live. I'm here with my mom, Isabel. This is another episode of My House Is Your Home. We're cooking up a storm. It's the long weekend. People are starting to arrive at my house, and I'm all about doing as much as you can early. My mom knows I like to be prepared, don't I? You do, and I think one of the fun parts of the weekend is going to be the preparation of the food. So we have done our chili. Now we're gonna move on to cook something else for you. You can hear kids in the background. It's all getting noisy in here. It's all about family. It's all about the weekend. It's gonna be fun. So we are making another Chef Andre dish because the thing I like about Chef Andre's food is it's healthy. It has great flavor and all that stuff. And they're super simple. So we're making margarita grilled chicken. We made margarita grilled shrimp last night, but tonight we're gonna make the chicken. So we've got our chicken. We've got garlic, we've got cayenne pepper, cilantro, a little bit of tequila, cause that's what you need in your margarita, and our olive oil and a lime. And salt and pepper. And a bit of salt and pepper. Okay, so we're gonna get this chicken going. So you can pop the chicken in this bowl. Are you, are you gonna marinate it? Yep, we're gonna marinate it. Um, it's best uh, to marinate for about 30 minutes if you can. Um, if not, a half it, half an hour is great, but if you, and four hours they say is kind of the perfect thing to do. So we've got that. We need a tablespoon of olive oil, mom. So you know what, if can you want to guess? Or? You can guess, just guess. We're guessers. I don't always like to measure because you know what, you gotta add and pull back and whatever. So mom, you can add the garlic. So the cilantro's gone in, the olive oil has gone in. Now we've got the garlic going in. Here goes the cayenne pepper. Cayenne kind of pepper is great for health too, you know. And we've got the two tablespoons of tequila. So here's I've one. I've never done this before. Have you ever cooked, well, except uh, for last that, night, right? Yeah, that, that's the first. There's two tablespoons and there's just a little drop for good luck. And apparently we've got some really nice tequila so we're gonna have to maybe blend up a margarita or something later. Now, if you want to, we need to zest a whole lime on here. So just swish it around like that. I'll grab our spoon and give it a bit of a stir. All right, so here we go. It is marinated. Have a smell of that, Mom. Mm. The flavors mm. are just unbelievable. And that's the thing about cooking these meals is it's all flavor and you can smell the tequila. It smells like a margarita. <laughs> so we're gonna get this going. Let's start the fry pan up. And as I said, you can barbecue this, which is what we did last night. We barbecued. Um, and we pan fried a couple of the prawns as well. So today we are gonna be pan frying. You wanna get your pan nice and hot because um, when, it hits the, when it hits the grill or the pan, you want it to sizzle, at least I do. And I'm, these are thighs, so I like to cook a thigh on the back side, the thicker thigh side first. So here we go, we're gonna get this in the pan. Let's hope it sizzles. Oh, listen to that. Isn't that amazing? Just what you want to hear. Exactly the sound we wanted. So there we go. That is cooking away. I'm going to drizzle this over here. Yes. Mom, what do you think? You've never cooked with tequila before. I've never cooked with tequila. Actually, I rarely ever cooked with wine because I was too tight to buy it. <laughs> All right, so we're going to let these cook away, and we will be back with a little bit of a taste test. Sounds good to me. Sounds good. All right, so we've just flipped these over. Here's a tip for everybody. When cooking meat, if it doesn't come off your pan easily, the meat's telling you it's not ready to be turned yet. So look at the color of this, Mom, and how the cilantro and the garlic has just infused itself into the chicken. It's going to be so tasty. It's going to be tasty, so stay tuned. We're almost there. Okay, margarita chicken, done. Again, this is a recipe that we have adapted, a Chef Andre recipe that we have adapted and made our own. We made the margarita prawns last night, but tonight we're making the chicken. I like this little, you know, it's, it's all kind of flavorful and you can see it. Mom, let's give it a cut. And I'm gonna let you have a taste of this, see what you think. Oh, we cooked it perfectly. It is divine. The juices are still in there. See, when you get your pan that hot, it seals everything in there. So we're gonna put this on the plate. I would serve this maybe on a bed of rice with a crunchy salad, fall roasted vegetables, really nice. Let's get some of the bits from the pan out of here. Okay, some of those nice those are, bits. They're so tasty. Yeah, those are the good bits. Okay, mom, 
you, since you tried the margarita prawns last night, we're going to let you taste the margarita chicken and tell us what you think. This is Here we go. Too big? Uh-huh. Do you want me to cut it a bit? Okay. Cut it a bit. Give her a small one. You taste one. I'm going to try one. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, that was a good recipe. Mm -hmm. So, oh my gosh, people get mad when we talk and chew and talk. That is a really good recipe. So simple, translates well from fish to chicken. We did prawns last night, we did chicken today. I bet you could do salmon, you could do anything with this. I think anything. How good? I, very good, and I think the marinating must really help too. Mm -hmm. That's lovely. All right, there's one more edition of My House is Your Home. I've been here with my mom, we've been cooking all morning. Preparing for Labor Day weekend, house full of people coming. We've still got the pulled pork. We're going to show you that one in another few minutes. And has it been fun? It's been great. It's all about handing down recipes from generation to generation and then throwing in some new ones into the mix to make life a little bit spicy. Very good. Thank you.